We are in the bathroom. That's right. Yes. We're here with a few ideas on how you can really upgrade the bathroom. You spend a lot of time in here. Paige Hemis is here yes. to lead us through this one. You know, you, I specifically spend a lot of time yeah, here. Is I that what you're saying? Uh, Mark, no, I'm confused what? about that statement. <laughs> no, but truthfully, I always say my two favorite rooms in the house are the kitchen and the bathroom. And I always, I always look at people's kitchens and bathrooms when I go to their homes. And actually, you're yeah. not alone because most homeowners, you can get the most bang for your buck if you upgrade the kitchen and bathrooms. Yeah. So a typical bathroom upgrade will be about ten to fifteen thousand. I'm going to show you about ten to fifteen dollars wow. to One upgrade simple it. Wow. Simple, simple, simple. We're not talking about remodeling. We're talking about just little things you can Slowly. use to give it a little fresh. All right. Up. So, what are some basic things that I can do at home to zhuzh up my bathroom? The first thing you want to do is check your towels. Now, a lot of us have towels that maybe have gone to towel heaven. And you change them so, only when the guests come? Yes. <laughs> the good I, towels? The good towels. <laughs> I say go with bright white, crisp white. But if you have a special one color at home, you can use that. But see, just set a couple of nice new towels out and beautiful. roll them up so the guests feel like they can use them, that they're not like the guest towels that you're not allowed to touch. And then on either side, I added some fresh lavender. You can go, go out to your yard, grab whatever flowers you have mm -hmm. to just have fresh flowers when you have friends come over. That's right. true. Any plants? Plants immediately really freshen up. A place. Yes, it's so true. I'm really That's digging what you got going on here. Are these? Is this soap dispensers? These are dueling. These are actually really cool things that you can get. These are mason jars wow. with a pump top. Now you can get any type of soap or lotion that you like. I mean, I would say invest in something nice so your guests have something nice, or go to the 99 cent store, get something, and put it in this. Makes it look like it's a hundred dollars. I know. Yeah. I'm ashamed but maybe. to say I've, I have my just the, the soap plastic. dispenser from the CVS that you just. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, it smells good. It smells but it doesn't good. Look good. And right. a lot of times it is great soap and it smells great. But if you put them in little jars like this, all of a sudden it looks uniform. It looks, and it looks like. Fancy. I feel like I'm at a yeah. spa. Now, yes. what about my makeup and my makeup brushes? Because they tend to get scattered all over the counter, and my husband does not like that at and all. You, don't, don't you, think you paint quite a picture. He does. Yes, yeah. I think a lot of girls do. I know. And when we're getting ready, it's it's you take these brushes, and it's everything is, yeah, and, and then, then throw you throw them. it. Mm. But if you have this, you throw them right back in there, and it keeps them. You do you can do your uh, cotton swabs, your cotton balls, anything that you think your guests might need extra soap. You can put them in little jars. It just looks pretty. Can I ask you about like if you wanna if you don't have a lot of space, a lot of bathrooms don't have yes. a lot of room in it. Actually, this is very spacious. Mm -hmm. But if you don't have that kind of space, yes. and you want a storage, but you want mm -hmm. it a little chic, you want it mm -hmm. to feel kind of like it's cool and not just yeah. like a basket, a wicker basket, right? Like yeah, room. full of extra toilet paper, that, right? Yeah, that yeah, everybody yeah. does. That's which I exactly. Do. And yeah. a lot of people have pedestal yeah. sinks or sinks, which is just that sink that has no storage. Yes, true. So I've come up with a good way to make it look very light and airy. It's actually very cool. As a nice oh, way to almost make it like a display. And this is actually not something that I came up with on my own. Yeah. It is Bertrand Jair, and it's called Uncommon Goods. I saw oh, look, this. Oh, there you go. I thought it was like a little. It's looks almost, like an art installation. I got to be honest. It does. It does. Right? It does. And his was ninety nine dollars. So of course I. I thought, with that inspiration, how can I make it for cheaper? And I got started this morning. I'll show you guys oh, how I did it. Say. Yes. I did it with things you use in the bathroom, but not typically. PVC pipe. <laughs> okay. This, this is what like, will be wait, under what? your house. Uh -huh. Yes. And I did it. I cut it in four inch lengths and you can get six inch, eight inch, whatever inch you want. I used six inch there. And then this is my little Dremel tool, which is just a cutting tool. And I cut it in half all the way down. So this is... Honestly, this guy's it is so cheap, it's plastic, and it works so well. So you go all the way down with your little cutting tool there. Once it's apart, it almost like melts it a little. Yeah. Then you pull it apart. Now from here, this is where it really gets technical. I have joined this with my favorite, the glue gun. Nice. This is wow. so easy. So advanced, and huh? It really is advanced. And because it is so hot, it, it sets up almost immediately. And there you see, there I did six. But in the bathroom, you can do a little bit smaller. We only had room for four here. Mm. So I brought it in here, just added our toilet paper on top, and I feel like it looks like a cloud. It looks very fun. It does look like a cloud. I don't have the saw, though. To do if you don't have the saw, ask your hardware store to cut it in okay. four-inch lengths for you, Wonderful. and that will work. And I see you've also upgraded with the TP itself. 
We did this a is the This is the good Quilted Northern 4-in-1 Mega Roll. Yes, way, it I'm is. Gonna, I'm going to tell you, I upgraded uh -huh. my bathroom with these because we had the big wedding and the surprise yes. party. I didn't want it running out uh -huh. always, so we so, upgraded. <laughs> it's bigger, it's softer, it's more flexible, and God knows we'll need this for our tears.